here it's we are. Here. After all that preparation. Oof. It's been quite a lead up this last week. I caught camp plague last week. You're better though. I am. I, I do recommend though that people avoid the water. I, I think there might be something in the water here at Camp Magic McGuffin. Okay, I'll have to make a note of that. Maybe uh, boil yeah, the water for a few weeks or at get least. Get some of those iodine pills. They might help. Maybe you could ask the home office if they could send somebody out to test it. Yeah, they need to get yeah. on that. We, yeah. need, we need good water. but never know what that's all about. It's here. We got but we're here. Students are coming in today. Yep, we've got them. They've been registering. They've been contacting us. We've got some announcements we need to make. Right. About what's going to be happening this week. Um, and uh, just as we kind of get geared up. So first off, I guess for our UMW students, most important thing, if at all possible, by the end of the day today, you want to make sure you've gotten us information about the domain you want to use. Right. So, and just and some people know. might be confused. We're not asking you to go out and buy a domain. We just want you to pick the one that you uh, imagine and foresee being your presence for this course and beyond. Yeah, and when you pick a domain name, I mean, basically a domain name is just a web address. Uh, it can be a .com, it can be a .org, it can be a .info. .me's are good too. A .me, yeah. a .net. Um, it can be any of those, but you need to make sure it's available. So like if you try and go uh, pick Amazon.com, we Gone. can't get that for you. Yeah. Somebody picked it, somebody snatched that up a while ago. It's pretty expensive, yeah. Yeah. So to, to check if it's available, you can just try to go to the site. Uh, but sometimes that's a little tricky. I recommend going to a site like GoDaddy or on our registration form, we have a link to another one, Instant site, Domain yeah. Search. And it'll just let you put in a domain name and it'll tell you, hey, this is available or no, sorry, someone else owns this. Right. And you want to find one that's available. And then what do they do? Right, so that's really critical. That's the one you got to uh, nail that one down today. And we also want you to, um, we're sending out an email and putting a blog post up, uh, letting you know that you want to create your Flickr accounts and your Twitter accounts. Most importantly, get those set up right away because we're going to start communicating uh, by those means. But um, get to the ds106.us site if you haven't already uh, create your account and put in these details so put in that domain name where it says uh, blog URL because that's what the information we're going to use as we begin to set up yeah we'll be looking domains. there yeah for the domain that you're looking to use right and if you if you set up an account but you didn't provide a domain name or you put in something that was wrong go back McGuffey is coming after you probably yeah he uh, he's he's got he can he can be very vengeful. Yeah. McGuffey, if you don't follow directions. So yeah. go back, edit your account, put in your blog address now right. um, so that we can, we're, we're monitoring those, we're keeping an eye on those, and we're getting things set up on our end so that we can start getting your domain names hooked up to a web hosting account. And by the end of this week, you individually, each of you will be going, these are for the Mary Washington students, will be going and installing WordPress, which is a blogging mm -hmm. platform. Great one. Um, and I'm going to be putting together some videos about how to do that. It's real easy. Um, so that you'll be up and running by the end of the week. You'll be publishing, and, and uh, end of the week activities is going to be what we always call our, our letters to home. Yeah, we'll tell write a letter home. What, what you did in camp that week. Every Friday, you're going to write a letter home. Right. Um, on your blog, um, you'll be doing other things on your blog, but at least every Friday we'll see a letter home, mm -hmm. um, kind of summarizing this week's activities, what right. you learned, what you liked, what you hated. Uh, you'll get a little creative with those as the right. semester progresses. And also, as, as uh, just to go back, when you're creating these accounts, uh, go in and look to see how you can personalize them. Don't take the default icons that you get. Um, we, we talked about this thing called an avatar or, or a graphical representation. Everybody and, needs one. Yeah, and put that on the DS106 site, too. So we don't want to see you carrying around the default DS106 right. uh, skull and crossbones. Because there would really. be a lot of skull and crossbones. We would know. That's we right. We tell them all, all apart. And this course is all about being unique and you and expressing yourself. And setting yourself. up your identity. So this is the first step to doing that. So get that account set up, share your domain, get all those social media sites set up, mm -hmm. and put all that information in your DS106 mm -hmm. account. And, and that's for our UMW students. That's right. That's right. Uh, for your open online students, um, you can uh, set up your blogger anywhere that you uh, can manage. It can be blogger. It can be WordPress.com. It can be your own hosted site. Uh, but you'll want to put that address um, into your profile as well so we know to connect you. So your stuff that gets published gets sucked right into the Camp into the Magic camp McGuffin website. site, which yeah. is looking great. It is. We're put, we've been added a few features. We're going to be adding a few more, mm -hmm. kind of getting stuff, stuff spiffed up. I like the idea for the bulletin board on the side. Yep, right? there's going to be every week there'll be a to-do list where you'll get a list of your camp chores, mm -hmm. what it is, so that if you're not quite sure what it is right. that I'm supposed to be working on, that's right. a quick place to go. If we have to update anything, we can quickly add it there. Right, so you know, it might be you know making two videos this week. It might be cutting down some trees in the back 40. It could be all kinds of camp. That's right, you know. yeah. K uh, kitchen duty. 
kitchen duty. Making yeah. us dinner. Yeah, someone's got to clean the dishes. Speaking of which, let's tell them a little bit about what they're going to be doing this week this in addition week. to all that account right. wrangling. Right. So a few things. We're going to get you started into a regular practice that we call the Daily Create. So um, this week we're just going to ask you to do one, but in future weeks we'll probably ask you to do two or three. These are daily challenges that come out at tdc.ds106.us. Uh, we've picked a special one on Wednesday, uh, which I'll, we can sneak and tell them ahead of time, but mm -hmm. it's, it's telling a story of a family legend. Um, and it's a great way to introduce yourself. So we want you to get some practice of shooting your own video, talking to the camera, and getting to know each other. Uh, how you do your video is up to you. Uh, a lot of people can do it on their mobile phones and post to YouTube. Uh, I think the easiest way, if you have a laptop uh, camera, is just to go to YouTube.com, go to Upload. There's a place you can record directly in a webcam, and it gets published to YouTube. There's actually a little editor built right into YouTube, too. If you, want it, if you wanted to get fancy and add some titles and music, yeah. you can. Yeah, so um, for all these things, you know, feel free to modify and go beyond yep. the basics. But this is a good practice to get up to speed with the Daily Create. So we'll ask you to be doing that one on Wednesday. If you want to do more, you might get camp bonus points. And then also we're going to be asking you to watch a longer video. It's about 45 50 minutes. It's a, a speech by a, a brilliant colleague, uh, Dr. Michael West from Kansas State, who was at University of Mary Washington last year and gave a talk that really kind of frames the whole idea about um, what the web is and how important it is to sort of have your own stake and place in it. And engage with it and why it is we can't just sort of abdicate ourselves from that, that conversation. So it's a great frame. It's a great way to get started. It's a little long, but uh, yeah. he's a great speaker. I know everybody will enjoy it. Right. And as you're watching the video, um, take some notes and think about some things that either resonate with you or, or jump out. Um, think about, you know, he shows a lot of examples that illustrate his points. You may want to find your own examples, and you're going to be asked to write up something, uh, sort of a reflection on this. Uh, and you'll be doing a lot of this reflecting on your And blog. this is a lot of setup this week, so there'll, there'll is, be a yeah. fair amount of things to do to get the blog set up. You're going to want to start like fiddling and maybe you know, dressing up the blog and making it your own, getting used to writing to it. Um, we want to get the communication channel set up, so um, really make sure you, you get the hang of doing Twitter and using the DS106 hashtag. Follow us on Twitter. Yep, yep. We'll be following you back. We'll be uh, announcing whenever a new student mm -hmm. gets up on Twitter so that people know who you are and to follow you. Right. And then on Thursday, we will have our first um, synchronous session right. for the class. We're going to be doing these every week. Since it's an online course, you're not expected or required to be at these, but we encourage you, if you can, mm -hmm. to try and make as many as you can. We're going to be alternating the time. So this week will be Thursday at 4 o'clock e um, Eastern Standard Time. Right. Next week will be Wednesday at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, and we'll alternate those days and times every week. And these, um, these are these are our campfires, so we'll be out there by the pit. That's right. Um, which is looking really it spiffy. Is. What do you think of the office? It's these nice. walls it's are nice, nice, huh? I know. Yeah, I, I kind of like it. It really works. It gives that whole woodsy feeling. Yeah. And, and it's it's really an informal chance opportunity to get to meet each other, ask your questions, find out what's going on. You'll start to meet some of the other people who participate in DS106 who are not UMW students. Um, we'll be doing this week's in uh, Google Hangout, which is a tool that allows people to have uh, video chats uh, in one synchronous place. Um, so you may, if you haven't done a Hangout before, you may just want to look up some information, but there'll be more or less a link that you go to. Um, you have to log into Google with a Gmail account. Which it looks like most people have been setting up if That's they didn't good. have already. Yep. And uh, it seems like, you know, from what we've seen already with the first group, people are pretty adept. You know, I've seen some, some students who are already uh, pretty active on Twitter already. Yeah. That's great. Um, but again, because, you know, you know, we are here at this camp together, um, but we're not sitting in the classroom together. So you really have to, like, stay up to speed with the communication and contact us um, if you need anything. And really, Twitter is one of the best places to ask for help. We're always on Twitter. I get messages on my phone when somebody sends me a direct message. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm actually quicker usually at responding on Twitter than on even, even on email. And in fact, for the Google Hangout, Alan and I will be tweeting the link to it right before that at 4 o'clock on Thursday. Right. Um, so that, so when you, if you want to join in, all of you, UMW students, open online students, keep an eye on us on Twitter, and we'll be sharing that that afternoon. Um, so, um, so that's so this week. Ex setting up all this stuff. Except, except I got that message. Home office wants me to come out this week. But you're going to... I'm going to be here, right? but I'm actually going to have to be there. traveling on Wednesday, okay. so I will, you, I'll be here and there. But You'll be in both places at once. I'll be in both places at okay. once. Okay, yeah. so that'll be weird, but, yeah, but it'd be did they, have they told you any more about what this is going to be for? Uh, they, they just want kind of to review the checklist of all the things that they need for camp, and they kind of want to um, 
uh, make sure that all the the campers and the counselors are lined up and okay. all prepped up so you know it's it's the first time they've done other camps before okay. um, are you going to be asking them about some of the stuff that we uh, have been noticing around oh yeah i got the i got the master okay. list the, the red list okay. yeah because yeah. there's some definitely some I know. some strange stuff we I need know. to follow up and on. And that, that shed number four is really kind of worrying me. Me too. So um, so that's great. So uh, to recap, set up WordPress. We're going to do that at the end of the week. Get us yeah. your domain name. Set up all those accounts. Do that ASAP. Right. Um, now it's going to take us. Uh, we're still yeah. um, uh, there's still some work going on in the very very back, um, getting the the blog hosting set up. But mm -hmm. that should be uh, up and going in a couple of days, and we'll be contacting you. Uh, by email and giving you some steps, and there'll be some more blog posts on the site with how to do the, the WordPress and yep. the system called Plesk that you'll be getting That's into. right. Um, so you're going to get getting all of that set up. Watch the video from WESH, which will be posted on uh, the camp website. Um, on Wednesday, uh, do your daily create. Yeah. Or your introductory video yeah. family legend. And then on Thursday, for those of you who are available, join us around the campfire. Right. And all of this, like we said, will be summarized on the site. If you have any questions, don't sit there and go, Duh. send us a message, because we can't help you if we don't know that there's a problem. Yeah. So the worst thing you can do in an online class where we don't see you every week is to disappear and just give up. Right. Um, we've got your back, but we need to know right. if there's a problem. And you might so. hear a little at your window. I hear he's getting a Twitter account. Yeah, oh, McGuffey is, mm -hmm. yeah. So yeah, McGuffey's gonna be on Twitter too. He might too. be at your window going, hey, how come you haven't set up your blog? You should keep your window shut. Yeah. You don't want him coming in in the middle of the night. He's nice. Look at those eyes. Tell me again about your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right, I think that's about it. Uh, we will be doing meeting again next Tuesday, not on Monday, right. because next Monday we all need to memorialize. It's a holiday yes. for Memorial Day. Um, but Alan will be joining via some virtual yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. And uh, we'll be having a video next Tuesday summarizing next week. And in the meantime, we'll see you all on Twitter right? and uh, around camp. Get your camp hats on, man. Have, it's yeah. going to be 10 weeks of fun creativity. That's right. Have a great time. Cut. Hey, that was good. It's a lot of stuff, man. It's a lot. It, well, it is a lot. I, I, so, um, so you have a whole list of this weird stuff? Yeah, we've, okay. we've been working on that. You know, I got the I clipboard wanna, with okay. all the things on there. I just haven't seen the clipboard, so I just want to make sure. I mean, I know you always you're always writing on it, but I don't get to actually see it. No, but so I, I just want to make sure that everything that I've been telling you about that I've been seeing, you know, the stuff down by the lake, right, which is right. really weirding me out, you know, and then uh, you know the whole like thing me getting sick last week. I'm I'm kind of worried there might be something in the water. I, I think you should see. Um, I think you should see nurse. What well, you know, I nurse? had to stop. Who's the new nurse? Uh, I can never remember her name. Spatchet, Spriggis. Spra scratch it. Scratch it. Nurse Scratch it, I think. Nurse Scratch it. Yeah. Well, I had to stop taking all my medications because I was so sick, so that hasn't helped. But you know, I'm 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 feeling a little better now, and I just want to make sure that you cover all of this stuff I'll, with I'll, the home I, office. I have it in my it's in my backpack, you, okay. and, and I'll bring it over to your bunk later. And Are you gonna let me look at the clipboard? Absolutely, man. Okay. I just, all right, I just no, want to make sure. There's nothing secret here. I mean, you got the camp experience, you know, and the DS-106 experience. I'm the rookie here. Well, yeah, okay. All right, well, I guess this is it. You'll be leaving, what, tomorrow? I'll, I'll be I headed out I'll be, Wednesday I'll morning. be in charge. I'm, I'm totally in charge here while you're gone, right? You're totally I in charge. I get to make all the rules? Yeah, that's right. Oh, okay. You, you have full access to the control panel. And okay. You can you can operate all the, uh, the okay. levels. and. I get, all right. Can I fire anyone? We're the only ones working here. The counselors <laughs> are volunteers. <laughs> Can I? Okay. We, yeah. All right. I won't fire yeah, we anyone. Yeah, we got to get some word out to the counselors, too. Um, that hatchet guy is uh, he's still a concern. Well, is that guy still wandering around in the woods? Oh, the that Australian? Guy, that Australian? I don't know why he went to Kentucky. That was and, weird. And I told him to sit still, but he just wanted to walk here. That's but. weird. I don't know about him. I think we need to keep a close eye on him. You might want to mention him to the home office. I spotted him. Could he be? Yeah. I thought they had a tracking collar on him. Really? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. They're, okay. they're supposed to be able to track all our counselors. All of? What about our campers? Them too. Yeah. What about me? Well, yeah. What about you? Yeah, of course. Oh, okay, just checking. It's all, I'm gonna, um, it's all about the safety plan. I'm going to go lie down on the hammock for a little while. It's been a long day. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a spin out on the lake. I just love the new kayaks. Yeah, you're going to miss it while you're gone. I know. That's why I want to get my strokes in. <laughs>